Well, the Iowa racetrack is just laid out really well to put on great racing, where the cars can run side by side uh, and really put on the type of racing that we think our fans enjoy. Uh, super competitive, uh, great layout where the fans can see the racetrack from all different angles. And it's a great experience. So, uh, for all the parties, and I think that's great for Chandler. I think Iowa sort of gave welcoming uh, this cup series. Well, if, if the state of Iowa welcomed us the same way they did when we came here for the National City Series for an all event in 2009, we're going to be blown away. Uh, just so well done. It was so great to see the fans and just love our sport to death. And uh, it was certainly a racing community that uh, I think is really going to embrace this event. How excited are you just in general for this track to be all beyond one that's so fast, so fast? Well, I think the Iowa track is laid out really well with progressive banking. Uh, and that progressive banking allows the cars to race in all different spots. And uh, then you can really make moves as a driver, and that's a lot of fun. Do you think NASCAR has made enough moves to their short track package or in a direction that gives you confidence that this product can be well at well, The big thing about this track is it's somewhat agnostic to the cars because uh, of the progressive banking. You can find different areas to run and make speed. And I think that, that kind of works its way out. Do you, would you compare Iowa closer to a intermediate on the schedule today or a short track like Richmond? You know, it's, it's really not a short track or an intermediate. It's its own type of track. It's got its own identity. I think that's really important, too. It's one of the great things about that facility is uh, there's nothing else like it. They mentioned possibly paving the track. I know there's a lot of talk about the pumps and things. How would that improve it or how would that change it? Well, I can't speak too much about it. I haven't been on the track in a couple of years to know uh, the condition of the pavement. But there's always investments being made, and I'll defer to the experts on that. Mm -hmm. She got cut with a sword. Thanks, guys.